The cost of managing unstructured data growth has skyrocketed. As organizations struggle with the complexity of this new data type, it is further compounded by the typical silo approach, which results in underutilized and insecure infrastructure that has evolved rather than been planned, and particularly a challenge for many small, medium-sized, and enterprises with remote offices and branch offices. Storage administration expertise is often required to manage application data and file shares, especially when dealing with the collection of different interfaces found in legacy infrastructure. As a result, storage costs continue to increase, diminishing the return on investment and productivity. These challenges are forcing IT to reevaluate their approach to data protection, particularly with regards to where they choose to store their data and how it should be backed up. Cloud-based data protection solutions offer access to remote, highly scalable, managed service-based operations. Leveraging the cloud for backup and recovery helps reduce costs related to dedicated backup infrastructure. It offers budget flexibility with a pay-as-you-protect model and makes the task of managing data protection easier, which reduces the operational burden on IT. Cloud backup can also assist with compliance initiatives and concerns. As well, it enables a form of disaster recovery for most customers. In the case of smaller IT environments, cloud-based backup helps avoid additional backup-related capital expense altogether. Today's demonstration will focus on how to leverage cloud-based backup to protect HP StoreEasy storage appliances. Let's now take a look how you can leverage cloud protection for your critical file data. HP StoreEasy provides administrators with an incredibly simple yet powerful way to deploy shared storage in their data center. Within the StoreEasy Administration Config tool, you can not only gain access to information as to how to set up and configure your appliance, but how services such as Cloud Backup can be leveraged to augment the typical on-site backup solution with a scalable pool of off-site secure backup storage resources delivered through HP's Autonomy Live Vault service. HP's Autonomy Live Vault is a fully managed cloud-based data protection service that automates, streamlines, and reduces the complexity of server data protection. It offers long-term retention and disaster recovery in the cloud, and Live Vault provides unprecedented scale to meet the data protection demands of the largest customers in the world, some with the toughest SLAs. Before we get started on the configuration aspects of Live Vault and see how it works, let's first create some sample file data to represent the typical customer environment and then let's leverage the server manager within StoreEasy's admin tool to create a file share. We'll start by simply creating a file share on our G drive called demo share, and I will select an area of the file system to share and we'll later add files to and then remotely protect using LiveVault. After we've finished configuring the share, let's simply commit these changes and move along to focus on the demo, which is providing file-based protection using LiveVault. Let's now switch over to the LiveVault management user interface, which is web-based. The technology is agent-based and installs on physical and virtual servers directly on a protected system, in this case, the HP StoreEasy appliance. As we initiate the protection of this system, let's first define the backup policy, meaning what we plan to protect, how often, and how long we plan to retain copies of the protected data in the cloud. As you can see, creating a new policy is very straightforward. We simply define the name of the new policy, the location of the file system we want to protect, and we can even zero down into the hierarchy of specific file objects. Here you can see I'll simply select some files within the directory we've created within the server manager when configuring the StoreEasy appliance. And the next part of the policy to consider is when to backup. There are a number of options from continuous to scheduled, and depending on the volume of information and criticality, this would dictate your recovery point objective, or what we call an RPO, and the frequency of protection. You can see there are many options to choose from. With respect to data retention, LiveVault provides a number of flexible policies to meet your business and compliance objectives, such as 30, 90 day, one year, seven year, and even customer retention schedules available on request. After we've completed the policy configuration, we'll see a brief summary. Let's click Done to continue and start the backup process. After the policy runs, we'll see an updated status as to how much was protected and the time the backup started and completed. After reviewing the job summary, let's simulate an event such as data loss or deletion of information on a protected host. I'll manually delete some files from the file system, and then we'll in turn leverage LiveVault to recover the data to a safe point in time prior to that event. Next, we'll initiate the recovery of our critical information. To initiate a recovery, we'll need to create a restore request. We'll choose the data that we seek to restore, the exact version of files, and a place to restore it to. The options on restore type are also quite flexible. I will choose to restore from a LiveVault cloud service or 
if I want from an immediate copy of protected data, I'll leverage something called a Live Vault Turbo Restore appliance. This is a local cache of backup and recovery points, typically five to six weeks in age, and it is also periodically synced off-site with a Live Vault cloud. If the volume of data is in the several terabytes, we also have an option of leveraging a Media Restore device. This is a service option that enables customers to gain access to bulk restore capabilities. If chosen, LiveVault Operations seeds restore data into an HP appliance and that is shipped to a customer's location where they can restore larger amounts of protected data. This is done locally and saves time and network resource. Once we've selected the option to proceed with restoring over the internet, we will present it with a similar navigation illustrating protected data for a given protected system. You simply choose the folder, individual files, and even drill down to specific versions of that information you'd like to recover. LiveVault can create multiple recovery points up to 96 per day to choose from. After we select the data to be restored, we need to define where and how to restore it, such as the original protected system or to redirect that restore to another system within the network. There are also a number of options as to how to restore the content, thus preventing you from overriding original information if needed. If we choose to redirect the restore to a new system, we can simply choose the system if registered with the LiveVault service and restore the data securely. Lastly, we can choose to schedule the restore at a point in time during that 24-hour period, perhaps during a maintenance window to ensure maximum access to network resources. The summary page, simply select Done to continue. In the restore summary screen, you can see the restore has been scheduled and completes within a few seconds of initiating the request. Optionally, customers can leverage the built-in reporting capability within the Live Vault user interface for both backup and restore events. In addition to generating reports on demand, report creation can also be scheduled and sent to an administrator via email in a variety of formats. HP's Autonomy Live Vault provides an efficient, secure, and simple solution for cloud-based data protection requirements for file data stored on HP StoreEasy Storage. Leveraging Live Vault with HP StoreEasy means turnkey data protection for critical file data, which allows customers to gain access to a scalable pool of cloud-based backup storage resources. This facilitates both backup and recovery requirements for off-site data protection, compliance, as well as disaster recovery for data that resides on an HP StoreEasy appliance. To learn more about how you can leverage HP Autonomy Live Vault to be used to protect the HP StoreEasy family of appliances, please visit autonomy.com/storeeasy.